And now from our studios in downtown Winnipeg, it's time for 107 Live. I'll be home for Christmas. Another 107 live with DMC Ice Jazz Choir from Daniel McIntyre Collegiate Institute. Welcome to the Classic 107 Studios. Would everybody like to introduce themselves? Shall we start with the Sopranos? You want to come to the, to the mic and introduce yourselves? Yeah? <laughs> Sounds great. Awesome. <laughs> Let's do it. Hello, I'm Kathleen. Hi, Kathleen. Who's next? <laughs> Hi, I'm Alicia. Hi, Alicia. Hi, I'm Kim. Hi, Kim. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Hi, Rebecca. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ketia. Hi, Ketia. Hi, I'm Maria. Hi, I'm Joanna. Hi, Joanna. Hi, I'm Angela. Hi, Angela. Hi, I'm Josh. Hi, Josh. Hi, I'm Rain. Hi, Rain. Hi, I'm also Josh. Hi, Josh, over <laughs> here. Hi, I'm Harvey. Harvey. And for those of you who uh, won't be able to see them, unfortunately, but you will be able to see them. We will post this up on our website so all your friends, fam, and audiences all over the world can peruse uh, these really exciting moments uh, here at 107. Cynthia, their beautiful director, would you like to join me uh, at the mic? Now, Cynthia payson Wall, she has, you have quite a few accolades as a conductor. Uh, and uh, tell us a little bit about what brought you to choral singing and what has made you the committed pedagogue that you are? I was actually a flute major. I was an instrumental major and mm -hmm. I thought that I would teach band. Okay. Um, and uh, every year I volunteered at a festival in Banff okay. that we've actually taken the kids to several times. That's great. And despite my commitment to instrumental teaching, I would ditch my post in the concert band venue at every opportunity to go check out choirs and to That's go awesome. <laughs> listen to jazz choirs. And so I finally figured out partway through my tenure that I was, I think, meant to teach choir. So when I got the opportunity to move to Winnipeg, I did teach a, take a, a job teaching uh, at R.B. Russell first okay. and started a women's choir there and had a lot of satisfaction, personal satisfaction from um, helping young women learn to use their voices and be empowered by using their voices. So I, when I started at Daniel, I got to kind of slowly worm my way into the choral program and it is what it is now. And you don't only uh, just conduct choirs, but you also teach uh, jazz theory. You teach piano as well. That's what I, I was reading. I teach piano class, yeah, and yeah. Uh, musical theater as well. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah. That's, I mean, what a well-rounded... Do you guys enjoy Cynthia's conducting and yeah. tutelage? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, well, she seems quite committed. So you also teach... Uh, or you conduct CMU's jazz choir as well. Yeah, absolutely. That's right. Yeah. So you have a very um, astute teacher um, um, ahead of you guys that's very then this is can you tell us a little bit more about the jazz ensembles at Daniel Mac sure we have um, four choral ensembles at Daniel McIntyre so there's the catch-all choir the concert choir which is open to every student it's non auditioned but then we do select singers for two jazz choirs so we have DMC chill taught by my lovely colleague in the corner uh, Graham Dion and then DMC Graham. ice which is the senior of the two jazz choirs we also have a vibrant jazz band uh, which has really fed the success of the jazz choirs as well. Uh, also taught by Mr. Dion. How many of you guys are also in jazz band or jazz improv class? Yeah. We so have one, two, three, four, five hands. Yeah. That's pretty great. Yeah, out of 12 singers. So 
there's a, a lot of crossover. We try and make the program as uh, inclusive as possible so that kids can do as many of those things as possible. So I think probably some of these guys are in five ensembles at the school. Yeah. Wow. Concert band, jazz band, vocal jazz, chamber choir, and concert choir. So. Well, no lack yeah. of well-rounded musicians yeah. in this room. I'm a little intimidated. I sang in a vocal jazz ensemble once when I was in my undergrad, uh, nice. and there were five of us. And Where was that? In, at the University of Colorado Boulder. It was, oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it was just, we didn't have a vocal jazz program, so five of us got together with the, the dean of the jazz program. But I, I I long for these crunchy bits of harmony. Do you, yeah. is that what like what do you guys love about jazz? Is there anybody that like w wants to talk about why they love jazz singing? Come on, this is radio. It's live radio. You got to do it. Do it now or forever hold your peace. Yeah, do it. Come yeah. on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We are having we are having difficulties oh, with Josh. with shy people. Okay, so Josh, number one. Hi. Uh, hi. <laughs> uh, thank you. Yeah, you can move the the mic if you need to. Uh, so, Josh, uh, what grade are you in? I'm in grade twelve. You're in grade twelve, and how long have you been singing uh, with Cynthia? Uh, two years. Two years. Have you enjoyed it? Yes, I hope it's... so. I bullied Josh into yeah. <laughs> Oh, did you? He was yeah. In band in grade ten, and then I gave him the eye, and he was afraid, so he joined choir. So I joined choir, yeah. So, so <laughs> Cynthia bullied you into this. This is good. Yeah. This is yeah. all right. You know, sometimes you need those those mentors who see the brilliance in you before you do. That's okay. Mm -hmm. um, so what do you love about jazz singing? What do you what do you enjoy about it? <sighs> There's, like, so much. Yeah. Um, I like, I just like listening to jazz in general. But yeah. But when we do, like, vocal jazz pieces with Miss Wall and listening to Chill Do It, I, I think it's just the harmonies. Yeah. I think that's the big part that... That's the big draw of attention. It's it's that it's everyone likes the crunch. It's the density. Yeah. It's that you know, puddingy harmony. It's not like yeah. the you know sparse things. It's it's gooey and delicious. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too. Good answer. Good answer. Um, so hey, do you guys want to sing something else for us? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we heard "I'll Be Home for Christmas," which is a an incredible standard. Um, you guys enjoy the the general standards, like you all know the Great American Songbook and that kind of stuff. Like you know, okay, yeah, yeah, we've got all nods. So we have again well-rounded musicians in the studio. Uh, what are we going to hear next? Uh, we're going to sing a jazz version of the Ukrainian bell carol, the carol of the bells. A jazz version of the jazz Ukrainian version. carol of the bells. I'm just going to move your mic, really quick. Oh, 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 there we go. All right, kids, let's do this. DMC Ice from Daniel McIntyre, conducted by Cynthia Payson Wall. Hark hear the bells, bright silver bells, now echoing good news they bring. Be of good cheer, Christmas is here, now all is well, sing we the world. Loudly they ring, each answering, filling the air, loudly declare. This is the year, peace will appear, hatred will cease, love will increase, song so sincere. A 
fantastic arrangement of Carol of the Bells. Another installment of Holiday Spirit from this group of honed high school harmonists from Daniel McIntyre Collegiate, DMC Ice, conducted by Cynthia Payson Wall. Thank you so much for joining us. What a brilliant gift you have given us today. Thank you. From our studios in downtown Winnipeg, you've been listening to 107 Live, Classic 107's Intimate Concert Series, the soundtrack for your life.